Minecraft Java edition on a Raspberry Pi? Let's find out. So I wanted to see if the Raspberry Pi 500 Plus could run Minecraft Java edition. Naturally, I started with the official Minecraft launcher, but no luck. It just wasn't compatible with the Pi's ARM architecture. That's when I turned to Prism Launcher, a community build alternative. I installed it using Pi apps, and to my surprise, it worked. Not just worked, it ran smoothly. I was getting 30 to 40 FPS in vanilla gameplay on a Pi, and that's actually wild. Feeling a bit ambitious, I decided to install Potato Shader just to see how far I could push the Pi 500 Plus. But the moment I launched the game in full screen, the FPS tanked to 10 and it turned into a slideshow, totally unplayable. But when I minimized the window, boom, back to 30 FPS. Why? Well, shaders add lighting, shadows and post-processing. Even lightweight ones like Potato Shader push the Pi's GPU hard, especially in full screen where resolution is maxed. Full screen forces rendering at native screen resolution, likely 1080p, increasing pixel workload. Minimizing the window reduces resolution, easing GPU strain. The Pi 500 Plus share memory between CPU and GPU. When running in shader in full screen, the GPU has to render at display full resolution, which can quickly exhaust available VRAM and bandwidth, leading to frame drop. In windowed mode, the rendering resolution is lower, reducing memory usage and GPU load. That's why performance improved. So yeah, Minecraft Java runs on a Pi. Just don't go full screen with shaders, unless you like slideshows. Want me to try another shader or mod? Drop your suggestion in comments.